So my name is Emmanuel Simon and um, I'm in U3 of uh, Management, the BPCOM program, and my major is General Management. I actually have a concentration in Marketing and Organizational Behavior. I would say a skill we learned a lot with Chantal Westgate was um, networking. What she did is that she always pushes her students to interact with each other, interact with her, and she always finds exercises for us to get to know each other, to actually build links with people in our classroom, and, and that way we, we learn how to go towards other people and, uh, and network. And I believe that's a skill that's useful anywhere, in the workplace, in school, and when we get older, and that's something valuable that I learned from, from our classes. So research in Chantal Westgate's class is very important, like actually most of the classes I've taken at McGill. We did a, a lot of primary and secondary research uh, th uh, throughout the three classes I, I took. So um, it just helped us build the skill set of um, knowing how to make research and how to like look through research through the McGill database. And um, through her classes and like McGill in general, we. After three years, three years and a half at McGill, I built a, a pretty good understanding of how to do research. And uh, I think that, yeah, Chantal Wiske's class were, helped me to get to the point where I am today. So, uh, professor Wiske teaches in a bit of a different way than most professors. Like, I would say that most professors teach in a rather dry method. Uh, it's very good, but um, usually they use PowerPoints, they, uh, they just uh, ask cl the class questions, and it limits itself to that. Chantal Westgate, it was, it's a lot more interactive. She, um, she concentrates on telling personal stories that she's lived in that field, or also by, uh, by um, making us interact with each other and teaching us a concept in a more um, active way. For example, in the cross-cultural management class, we, uh, we were taught about cultural shock. And uh, she decided that a good way for us to learn about cultural shock was to actually live a cultural shock. So she um, made us do a simulation in class that lasted two hours long. And we, um, and we were divided into groups that were two different cultures. And we, uh, and we had to do something that I'm not going to say here because I don't want to ruin it for fu future students. But um, it was a, a great way to learn. The retention was extraordinary in that method, and it was very fun. Every, um, every beginning of class, she gives us a, uh, an information card that we have to fill out with our names, our dreams, pretty much, and what we want to do. And um, she, she learns those. She actually tells us that she reads them at home, and she gets to know us. And after she includes us in discussions, she knows who's shy, who's not. She knows how to make us participate and how to, uh, to help us out if we're having problems. And she's very responsive, so that's that's a great aspect that would make a perfect professor.